Today we're going to talk about the Heart Sign Samaritan 360P and the Heart Sign Samaritan 450P. The demonstration will be given on the 450P, but during the demonstration we will point out the similarities and differences between the two units. Similar to the Heart Sign Samaritan 350P, we have the Heart Sign Samaritan 450P. They are both semi-automatic AEDs that require the shock button to be pressed when a shock is advised. The additional feature of your 450P is that there's a CPR rate advisor which will advise the rescuer if the compressions being given are too slow, too fast, and if they're just right, the light would light up right here in the middle. We also have the HeartSign Samaritan 360P. This device is a fully automatic AED. You will notice there is no shock button. This lightning bolt simply represents that it's fully automatic and the device will give the shock if it determines a shock is needed. So we have the HeartSign Samaritan 450P. That's 450P. You have a status indicator window that blinks about every five seconds indicating the machine is ready for use. On the back side you have the description, the serial number, the pad pack with the adult image showing the pad placement. The pediatric pads would show the pad placement of the front and the back. When you are switching out the pads you would pinch these in right here and that removes the pad cartridge. The pads are in here. The uh, battery is also located in there. So you have your pads and battery in one combo pad pack. To insert that in the device, clicks in place. And that light would begin to blink. On the 450P you have the too fast and too slow option so during CPR the device will tell you if you're going too slow or too fast. If your compressions are just right the light will light up in the middle. You also have graphics that show where you're at through the rescue process. You turn the machine on using your on off button. To download an event from the machine you're going to use the portal on the top side of the AED. To expose the electrodes you would pull this green tab and it pulls out a tray. Each electrode has an image that matches the image as shown on the AED. So this electrode would be placed in the lower left. This electrode would be placed in the upper right. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Please visit our website to learn more about our products and services.